Hey, welcome back to another demo, you guys. Okay, so we do not have a bath bomb today. Not just a bath bomb anyway. Okay, so this is a bath bomb slash bath truffle slash bubble bar. And this is from Copper Cat Apothecary. And oh, it's so cool. First of all, it smells really, really good. It smells like peach, candied peach, and it's very, very fragrant. And I don't know if you can see the texture really well. I think that you can. Um, it's hard to describe, but I thought about it and I thought about it and I <laughs> rubbed on it. Um, I think the texture is a lot like, y'all are going to laugh at me, the inside of an Oreo. <laughs> I really do. It feels like that you can see, I'm kind of rubbing on it a little bit here. Look, that's what it feels like. And it's, it's crumbly. It's a little bit crumbly and it's soft, but it's, it's a little just kind of dense and crumbly. Look, that is like the inside of an Oreo, you guys. That's what it reminds me of anyway. So anyway, this is, it's just so cool. Um, it's got cocoa butter, shea butter, and mango butter in it. So it's really, really moisturizing and it's going to bubble up for us. And it's just, it's going to be really, really cool. Um, this was in the last lavish box and I just knew I had to have one. So I was talking to the owner of the company and I said, I've got to get these before they're gone. So she was kind enough. She sent me two. So what I decided to do was I'm going to do them one each in a different way. So we can kind of see everything that they can do. So, um, I don't know. Let's go ahead and put it in and I don't know. Let's just play with it. Now I have seen this demoed and it just looks, it looks like it's just going to be a lot of fun. Now it's not going to fizz out quickly or anything like that. So I think what it's going to do, I think it's going to give us some nice foam. And I'll let it get wet for a few minutes. If you guys can hear that. So this is something I'm thinking when you get in the tub, you're just going to want to bring this in there with you and just kind of play with it a little bit. Oh goodness, it smells so good. If you like peach, you're going to love this. And it's nice and sweet. It's not too sweet. It's very fruity. There aren't too many bath bombs. Definitely not any bubble bars that I've seen. But I can recall off the top of my head, this smell like peach and I absolutely love peach. So I wanted to go ahead and get one of these before they were all gone because I knew that when the lavish box came out, now it's starting to foam in my hand more now that it's kind of got more water in it. Um, I wanted to get my hands on it before they all got grabbed up individually on her Etsy shop. She's an Etsy shop. Um, but she also, she's got another one out. It's the Gothic Unicorn and that one is scented in Dragon's Blood. So that one's going to be a good one for the upcoming Halloween season too. But um, yeah, it's kind of orange and purpley, so you're going to have to go check that one out too. And right now, this one is still available, so you could pick up both of them if you wanted to. But um, oh, it's just, it's so cool. This is so fun to play with. It's just really soft and foamy. Okay, so I'm going to grab one of these. Ooh, I'm try and squish it. Ooh, now this does not really feel like, ooh, it just blew up in my hand. This does not feel like inside of a bath bomb. No, it just blew up and foamed, really soft foam. And what that looks like is what it feels like in my hand. Let 
once the water hit it, it just turned instantly into that creamy foam. Ooh, it's really, really, really soft. Okay, so it's not really turning the water any kind of color, but I don't know that it was really supposed to, so I don't know that I was really expecting it to. Ooh, 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 soft, soft water. Okay, so what I'm gonna do now is I'm going to insert a clip of, um, I chopped up the other one, so that was really cool. And so you can see um, the texture even more of it, um, of the bark. And then we will watch um, what it does when we put it through a strainer. So let's go ahead and break to that. All right, guys, so we have it all chopped up. We have our unicorn butter bark all chopped up, and it's so cool looking. It's just soft, and I don't know, it's just airy looking. It's just, it was different than a regular bubble bar, obviously, because it's really not just a bubble bar. Um, okay, so let me go ahead and turn my water on. So go ahead and turn your volume down because it's gonna be a little louder for sure. So hang on one second. So it's definitely making a little more bubbles just kind of on the onset if you do it this way. So it kind of, you know, whatever your bowl is, I guess. But what you could do is you could just break it in half and kind of do, you know, kind of do both. All right. Okay, so this is what I have just running the water and I just ran it for a few seconds. Um, now, if you agitate your water at home, you're going to get more bubbles than this, but I'm not going to do that or I will be overrun with bubbles. So let's go ahead and turn the jets on and see what we've got. And the water is a light pink. It's almost, um, almost a lavender, but um, it's more on the pink side. Now these bubbles, I can already tell, are going to be super, super creamy looking. Oh, this is going to be nice. When bubbles are like that, they're very luxurious feeling. So I can tell I'll probably let those run while I'm in there as much as I can, unless they build up too much, but oh, those look fabulous. <laughs> they just look fabulous. And the scent, it's, it's beautiful. It's a beautiful scent. Oh my goodness. The creamy bubbles like this are really, really thick and dense. That's why they feel so good on your skin. Yeah, this is a home run. I'm, I'm a fan of the butter bark for sure. So this just was letting it run for just, I don't know, maybe two minutes at the most. So let's go ahead and check these out. Wow. Oh. This feels so, so nice and creamy. I wish I could back up a little more so you could see, but um, 
it goes about that that about that far down my arm not quite to my elbow now it would if I let it keep running but it's gorgeous they're gorgeous Okay guys, so I'm done with my Unicorn Butter Bark bath from Copper Cat Apothecary. And as you can tell, I was in there for a while because now my shades pulled down and it was just really awesome. I, the moisture level was out of this world. I do not need a lotion or a body butter. As you can tell, there's really nothing left in my bathtub. There's a little bit of glitter left on the side there where I was leaning up against the tub. Like I said, I was in there for a while. The peach smell was amazing and I just feel so, so soft. Um, this was a really fun demo for me. I really enjoyed it. So um, all of her links to her Etsy shop are gonna be listed down below. And like I said, there's still some of these um, peach butter bark bars <laughs> left in her shop right now, but she also has the Gothic Unicorn Butter Bark in her shop as well, and that one is scented in Dragon's Blood. So definitely go ahead and check her out, and she does have a lot of um, fall stuff coming up too. So go ahead and check her out, and I appreciate you guys watching like I always tell you. So um, thanks, and I guess I'll just see you back here next time. See ya. Bye-bye.